I'm not gonna click on show key and blur it because there is always someone in the comments that will download the video, download this video, go frame by frame by frame and still find the stream key because you wanna, you don't wanna share this stream key with anyone because if anyone gets this stream key, they can stream on your channel. So I'm not gonna click on show key. <laughs> What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Twitch tutorial and in this video guys, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to stream on Twitch with OBS. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to put in your stream key, how to put in the right settings to stream in HD on Twitch. I would say make sure to smash the like button down below already and I would say also make sure to smash the subscribe button down below and I would say let's get started. So as you can see right now, we are on twitch.tv slash dashboard. I'm on my dashboard right now and as you guys know, probably may know I'm a Twitch partner uh, for people who think Alex you're not a Twitch partner what are you talking about well as you can see right here it says partner settings so I'm actually a Twitch partner and I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to uh, stream like I said uh, on Twitch with OBS as you can see I have opened OBS twice so I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to put in the settings uh, in OBS because I need one OBS for recording everything like this video and one instance of OBS just showing you guys how to actually put in the right settings. So it is all in Dutch guys but I will translate it uh, for you. So we're gonna go to settings, click on settings and what we're gonna do then is we're gonna go over to the encoding tab. Now right here you will see the maximum bitrate and the buffer size. Uh, it is all optimized for recording so I'm gonna go to broadcast settings and I'm going to pick a modus and I'm going to pick live stream as you can see. Then what we're going to do is we're going to pick our streaming service which is going to be Twitch as you can see. And right here uh, this uh, FMS URL you want to pick location that is as closest to you. So as you can see I have a lot of uh, different options but for me if I go to uh, let's see where it is uh, Paris or London. Uh, or even Amsterdam is, a clo is the closest to me, so I'm gonna pick that one. And right here you want to fill in your stream key. Now what we're gonna do to find that key is we're gonna go back to uh, our browser. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the dashboard on Twitch and we're going to pick, we're gonna click on settings right here. Then we're gonna click on stream key. And right here it says show key. Now I'm not gonna click on show key and blur it because there is always someone in the comments that will download the video, download this video, go frame by frame by frame and still find the stream key because you wanna, you don't wanna share this stream key with anyone because if anyone gets this stream key, they can stream on your channel. So I'm not gonna click on show key, but you want to click on show key and then you want to fill in that one right here in this uh, path for stream key. So I'm gonna just fill it in real quick. So when you click on show key right here, it even says never share your stream key with anyone or show it on your stream. Twitch staff, admins, or global moderators will never ask you for this information. Please click I understand if you understand the above and would like to view your stream key. So I'm gonna click on understand. So I copied my stream key. I'm gonna go back to OBS and I'm gonna press control V. You wanna fill in your stream key obviously. And then as you can see, uh, it says auto uh, connect so it means like when you go offline by accident it will automatically uh, connect within I'm gonna fill in five seconds right here then we're gonna click on uh, apply then as you can see we're gonna click on video and you just want to pick uh, your graphics card I have two as you can see I'm gonna pick the top one the GeForce GTX uh, 960 M we're gonna pick a resolution if we want to stream in you can choose 720 I'm gonna pick 90 by 1080 obviously you can choose on different like for FPS you can stream on 30 FPS 50 or 60 doesn't really matter and then we're gonna go back to uh, the encoding tab so you're probably wondering like Alex what do I need to fill in in the maximum uh, bitrate and buffer size well guys it all depends on your internet connection so let's say that you want to stream on 720p you want to do a speed test on speeddash.net and then what you want to do is you just want to uh, let me think how it works let's say that your minimum uh, um, internet speed to stream is has to be 2.5 upload you just want to disregard like the, the download speed and the ping but you want to just uh, keep in mind the upload speed so let's say that your so let's say that your upload speed is 2.5 we're gonna fill in 2500 and right here also 2500 but let's say that your um, internet speed is I would say 5 or 10 what you can do you can fill in the maximum bit rate that's 3500 3500 and right now you can stream on HD uh, 
you can choose if you want to use 60 fps it all depends on what you guys want but this is basically how to go to do it guys this is how you configure um obviously um obs and as you can see we have a lot of uh, warnings in dutch but you want to just click optimize and then they will all disappear and this is basically how to stream on uh, twitch what you want to do is you just want to click on start streaming and then you're live on twitch so that is it for this video thank you for the continued support i'll catch you guys tomorrow with a brand new after effects tutorial because this video is is usually uploaded on thursday but i decided to upload this on friday and obviously after effects is usually on friday but it comes on saturday so i hope you guys understand thank you for watching and i'll catch you guys in tomorrow's video just alex helper